God used Gideon to win battles. A man from the tribe of Manasseh, the lowest clan of the tribe, the weakest member of the family, and God used him to win battles. We see in 1 Peter 19 and Revelation 13 that there is a lamb slain from the foundation of the world. And the Old Testament is about showing the character and the nature of Jesus Christ. His love, his compassion, his forgiveness. He's a creator. And it's about showing this cross that was before the Old Testament, uh, teaching us about the cross. So Gideon must also fit that. Gideon, using the weakest of the family, and then to learn about Christ, we have a lesson there. Yes, Gideon was about God alone winning battles, but it's also a little lesson to learn that Jesus came as a baby, the weakest member of the family, just like Gideon, and God used that weak member, God used that baby to break sin, to defeat the enemy, to bring down strongholds. And God is able to use you. You have no excuses. There are no excuses now. God used someone weak. God used someone small. You need to move forward. Celebrate Jesus. Celebrate the Creator. Celebrate the King. And now, with the new year, move forward. Oh, that enemy's going to come. He's going to come anyway. So be ready. And God's going to use somebody to write that book. It might as well be you. God's going to use someone to start a church. God's going to use someone to write a song. God's going to send a missionary. You might as well be the one to go. You can be used by God to win battles and do great things. Hidden behind the power of the cross. So go this year. Let it be you and give the glory to God. Happy New Year.